Good morning on this Wednesday. Welcome back to 3 News First Edition. It is 614. The Nueces Junior Livestock Show is a South Texas tradition that is well underway on its second week of events. Now this morning we continue to highlight our youth connecting to agriculture and appreciating animals. We have Leighton Lahan joining us live from the Richard and Borchard Fairgrounds. Leighton, good morning. Thank you so much for being with us today. And first off, congratulations. I've heard you've placed three different times at this year's Junior Livestock Show. If you could tell us about your awards. Sorry, could you please repeat the question? Yes, of course. I understand that you've placed three different times this year at the Junior Livestock Show. Talk to us about it. Yes, ma'am. So I placed yesterday with my market lamp, Barry, as reserve grand champion. And I also placed top senior showman with my lamb, Barry. With my commercial red heifers, I placed first with my pen. And I'm so proud of how far I've come this year. And you, you also placed, you were third runner up in the Queens contest. Congratulations on that as well. So I understand your brother Pierce shared with us uh, earlier this morning that this is a family tradition. You be, you know, your family being a part of the Junior Livestock Show. Uh, who in your family introduced you to the Livestock Show and why did you decide to take part? Yes, ma'am. So the livestock show has played a very important role in our family's life, as well as agriculture. Both of my parents showed in the livestock show, but living on a farm, promoting agriculture and learning about agriculture has been so important to me. I think getting involved in the NCJLS has taught me so many new skills. I've been able to network with others, and I've learned the most important skill of responsibility. Now, what challenges did you and your brother face this time around with this cold weather? Yes, ma'am. So with the cold weather, we were unable to wash our sheep before the show. So we had to find other ways on how to wash them and keep them warm. The lambs, we actually had to double layer them. They're wearing a blanket under this purple blanket and then they're wearing a thermal blanket, which is an insulated blanket. So they're nice and toasty. <laughs> Don't worry, they're kept very well, very warm. I can tell that you are doing such an amazing job. And I also heard that lambs have different personalities. If you could describe yours. So for sure, Barry definitely has a little bit of a scaredy cat personality, but he's very sweet. He's very friendly and kind. But yes, I definitely have to say he's a little bit of a scaredy cat when it comes to new people. And I understand you're a 10th grader at IWA. You are involved at school. You're involved with the livestock show. You're part of the Queens contest. My goodness, I think you're off to an amazing start. What are your plans for the future after high school? I would like to pursue the veterinarian career and major in biomedical sciences. And I'm really just so thankful for what the NCJLS has given me to further my skills in the veterinarian career. I've learned so much about animals, caring for animals, as well as working with others with animals. Leighton, thank you so much for being with us this morning. You and your brother were dears. <laughs> uh, we appreciate you being with us. And of course, <laughs> continue to do what you do. Continue to work hard. We're very proud of you. Such cute kids. Impressive. Future I leaders, that. I right? mean, so involved in the community at school at the Livestock Show, Queen's Contest, and what, a two lot different animals. This, this is like the Super Bowl Ooh. for all these kids out but there. But this is so good. They keep, yeah. You know, as a parent, you keep them involved and busy. <laughs> that That's is true. very important, and they sure And the Livestock Show is coming up next week, and I'm sure they'll be paying close attention to the weather there as well. Which is another thing yeah. that they're learning. With the cold weather, yes. it's a whole different situation.